Item number SCP-5723, Security Level 5. Containment Class, Esoteric. Secondary Class, Gavura. Disruption Class, Amida. Risk Class, Critical. Special Containment Procedures. Note, Gavura classed items endanger the inner structure of the Foundation and limits the ability of the Foundation to carry out its secondary objectives. Containment procedures pending full investigation by Overseer Council. Description SCP-5723 refers to the sudden disappearance of 051 on September 8th, 2019. The exact cause of reason for 051's disappearance is currently unknown, and a top priority investigation is currently being conducted by the Overseer Council to find the whereabouts of 051 and the culprit, if there is one. History On September 8, 2019, an 05 Council Summit was held. All parties were registered as having attended, save for 051, whose presence was detected at the meeting. After waiting an hour for 051 to appear, the remaining 12 overseers dispatched units from MTF Alpha 1, Red Right Hand, and STF Alpha Zero, Backstreet Boys, to the physical and spiritual residence. 051's spiritual residence was noted to have completely deteriorated with trace amount of an unidentifiable concept. The physical residence, on the other hand, showed signs of a break-in, with most of the windows and furniture being broken or otherwise damaged. No evidence pointing towards the identity of the malefactor was found. The reason why the building's security systems did not activate is also unknown. As of writing, 2021, October 9th, 051 is still considered missing and no information has been found on the current location and status. Until 051 is found and safely recovered, the Ethics Committee is to take on the role of acting 051. Addendum 5723-1 Video Log On September 8th, 2049, the 30th anniversary of SCP-5723, a video log was received by 053 from 051's personnel identification chip, alongside two files titled readme.md and hi.jpg. The log was stated as September 5th, 2019, but the location could not be located. Following is a transcript of the video log. Forward, the following video was recorded from 051's PIC. As such, it is from the point of view of 051. How 051 was moved from the spectral to the physical form to allow use of the PDI and actions taken in this video log are known. Begin log. The video begins with 051 waking up. They were tied to a metal chair in a pitch black room. A single spotlight was cast over 051. Uh, hello? This is data redacted. Where the hell am I? Huh. Two gloved hands come into view from behind 051, applying the tape onto their mouth. You better keep that penny mouth of yours shut. I mean, no, it's good for you. <laughs> All five one struggles against the tape for five minutes, attempting to plead for help. Another entity, believed to be a man wearing a Richard Vicky J. Rat, the mascot of the Frankfurt Animation Company, created in 1928 by Joseph Frankfurt. Mascot costume walks into the spotlight. It looks at 051 for a moment before looking behind them. Gah, hey there, it's me, Ricky Rat. Welcome to my hangout, gang. Now, tell me, do you see a thief anywhere? Huh? Do you see a frickin' criminal in my hangout? The entity holds its hands up to its ear and leans in the direction it was looking, pausing as if listening for something. A few seconds later, the disembodied voices of children can be heard saying, Right here! Good God!
Golly, you're right. Here's the pirate. We might need a very special tool to handle this one. Oh, Brainy! Note, a cartoon character created by the Frankfurt Animation Company in 1932. Golly, here you go, Ricky! The same gloves from before enter the spotlight near to the entity, holding out a rusted crowbar. The entity grabs it, and the gloves leave the visible area. Ah, oh, gee, thank you, Brainy. Now let's see here. How many times I'm gonna have to use this handy dandy tool before you? Hell, oh, that's how many movies you watch without me even seeing a dime for it. Oh, five one protest from underneath the tape covering her mouth. Did Brainy put that on you? Jeez, always looking up for little trouble cases. Let's get that off, shall we? The energy reaches over and violently rips the tape off of old five one's mouth. Come on, overseer. Tell us, how many times did you watch the freaking Sour Legend? Note, an animated film reportedly made and released in 1986 by Frankfurt Animation. No known copies of the film exist. Without paying for our service, huh? You should be able to afford it. We know how filthy rich you are, Mr. V. Re the Redacted. And I swear to Joey himself, if you ain't paying us for some down with a man dumbass reason, there's gonna be a handy dandy too going up the reverent ass of yours. Isn't that right, kid? Yes, Ricky. Good, good. So, come on, they never talked it. How many frickin' times? I don't know what you're talking about. yahoo Cut the frickin' crap. We got our own little panopticon here at Frankfurt. We saw you pirating Sour Legend and Discount Magic. Note, an animated film made by Frankfurt Animation, supposedly released in 1976, Notably, the film contained an accurate portrayal of thaumaturgy, and records indicate that distribution of it was suppressed by the URU due to this reason. On the freaking Reptopicon! Don't think we're blind! Rodents are freaking everywhere, data redacted! We freaking see all! Nine times! I watched it nine times without pain! There! I said it! I'm a thief! I'm a criminal! You caught me red-handed! What do you look at that? He fessed up! Well, ain't that's well? Nine times! Wow! Just wow! There's got to be a new record! Get the frickin' rack, Vinny! We're gonna have some fun! And log! Upon viewing the above law, 052 refuted that she had been the one to introduce 051 to pirating. Due to this, 052 has been placed under high security with a majority of MTF Alpha 1 assigned to safeguarding her and her location. 051 was declared KIA. The Foundation is currently undergoing the process of promoting a new council member to take her spot. The location of the video log is still unknown, as are the whereabouts of the entities depicted within. Addendum 5723-2 Follow-up Following the retrieval of the video log, a message was sent to Frankfurt Animation Company. Note, a previously popular animation company founded in the late 1910s. Frankfurt has only recently resurfaced in the industry having returned from a 60-year-long hiatus. Of note is that the foundation contained no records of such a company until the retrieval of the above log. A full-scale operation is currently being done to investigate the nature of Frankfurt animation and the relation to the log. 2. Julie Dale, Frankfurt Chief Executive Officer From Foundation Department of Public Outreach Subject Questions. Julie, the old five council has recently received a video log from a high level staff who is currently considered missing, wherein they were kidnapped and brutally assaulted by an entity resembling your mascot. We would wish to inquire on any possible connections this entity has to your company and if we need to take action in regards to this. Likewise, we would wish to inquire 
on the legitimacy of this Metopticon. Dr. Frederick Hayden, Director, Public Outreach. Two Foundation Department of Public Outreach and Frankfurt Animation Board of Directors. From Julie Dale, Frankfurt Chief Executive Officer. Subject regarding questions. My dearest Hayden, I have no idea what type of snuff film you just sent me, but, and pardon my French, what the actual frick? Never in my 30 years of working with this company have I ever heard part, heard tale of a part of this company that partakes in such cruel acts of violence, especially against such an esteemed organization of your own. Although the way they did it may have been a bit harsh, I like to say that it was more than justified. Our animators worked tirelessly in our studios to produce such fine products for you to enjoy. I believe we deserve just a little compensation for that. Regardless, I've added the board of directors to this email. Some of the people on this board may have been here for ages. I'm sure there are better answers than I do. Sincerely, Julia Dale. All our dreams can come true if we have the courage to pursue them. To Foundation Department of Public Outreach from Frankfurt Board of Directors. Subject regarding questions. Ignore this. Forget this. Forget this person. It has jokes writing all over it. This isn't the first time this has happened. This shouldn't have happened again. Some things are better off for gone, Hayden. Don't mess with a rat. Meet me, dot md.